Good day folks, I'm here today to talk about the configurable menu, it's an A-plat made for Cinnamon and uh, as you all know the main menu you can do anything with that, you can change anything, you can resize, you can configure at all, so this is the configurable menu with the whisker menu over here, this is my favorite one, it's very similar to the XFCE whisker menu and you also can change it for let me show you right click right click in the menu configure we go over here menu layout so you can you have several different options over here there's a Windows 7 one looks very nice That is a Gnome Classic, or as well, Classic Gnome. And here you go. You can uh, remove the search bar if you want, but the search bar is very nice also because you can search all applications from here, like a bench whatever or you can search the web too so let's say you wanna look for Facebook there you go very nice very nice <coughs> let me see I have many of them let me I'll go really quickly each of them so you have a idea how they look like is on the full screen you can change all of this you can come over here and uncheck this and you're not gonna have the search anymore I like with the search there a lot resizing so you can resize from the menu like over here very nice accessible menu you can change everything you want it just awesome so what I want you guys to do is to try it to help us find bugs in this menu I'm helping the, the developer a little bit but I, I'm a noob so I don't know a lot yet I want you guys to help us find as much as as much bugs as possible and fix it because I think this menu deserves like to be the main menu in cinnamon just for all this customability it's just awesome my favorite is the whisker menu I ask I personally asked the developer to make it and he made it like in, in less than a day he was he was ready you know? so let me show you some things we can do here real quick for example you can show the menu box pointer which I hate it so like the bubble thing like the bubble menu so I keep it without it this ugly thing over here by default I think something like this yes like if you change your team this thing this gap over here is, gets even bigger which is very annoying so I like the old-fashioned way more like a Windows 7 or something like that Oof. excuse me so yeah if you guys wanna download this 
go over here on, on uh, github I'm gonna put the links in the description download from here and uh, check it out it's totally worth it it's still in beta but if you help the developer fix all the bugs and give some some nice ideas he he will definitely respond very quickly to you like he did to me and that's it let me just show you a small thing over here in the in the enorm classic again you can drag and drop stuff like applications to the to the desktop to the to the panel as well it's not this classic it's gnome classic sorry about that okay so let's say drop the calculator here there you go let's say you want bench over here there you go you can get rid of the favorites you can change everything with configurable menu that's everything uh, the, menu, the main menu doesn't do it you can do over here awesome that's something that i was looking for for a long time i think you all should check it out you know and share this video try this menu tell us if you find any bug test it another another small thing i want to show you guys when you get it okay download here i'm gonna show you how you how you install it Go over here, download the zip, phone folder, okay, I already have it over here, let me delete this, so you extract here, open the folder, copy the menu, go on your home folder, and then over here check show hidden files local share cinnamon aplets just paste over here paste it over here right click in the panel close this stuff over here Right click in the panel, add applets, here you go, configure the menu. And after the menu show up in the panel, what you have to do is uh, restart Cinnamon. You just right click over here, troubleshoot, restart Cinnamon. Because that is a, a small bug that the remove applet and configure doesn't show up. So after you restart Cinnamon, it will work. So that's one of the bugs he's working on it. So yeah, please try it. Very good.